30 under square root plus 5 under square root upon 30 under square root minus 5 under square root. How do we simplify this? To simplify it, we need to remove the square roots from the denominator. For that, we need to rationalize the denominator. Now consider multiplying it by 1. There is no change. If we multiply and divide it by the same number, it is like multiplying it by 1 because then both the number gets cancelled. Therefore, we multiply and divide it by the conjugate of the denominator. So, conjugate of x plus y is x minus y. So, conjugate of square root of 30 minus square root of 5, this will be square root of 30 plus square root of 5. And if we multiply and divide by this conjugate, then again there is no change in the question. Square root of 30 minus square root of 5 plus square root of 5. So, square root of 30 plus square root of 5 upon square root of 30 minus square root of 5. Then multiply and divide by square root of 30 plus square root of 5. The conjugate upon square root of 30 plus square root of 5. Now, if square root of 30 is A and square root of 5 is B, then the numerator in terms of A plus B times A plus B. This is equal to A plus B whole square. And we can expand it as a square plus b square plus 2ab. So, we can write square root of 30 square plus square root of 5 square plus 2 times square root of 30 times square root of 5. Then upon in the numerator, it is in terms of a minus b times a plus b differences of square. So, we can write a square minus b square. So, here we can write square root of 30 square minus square root of 5 square. Now remove the square root with this square. So it is 30 plus 5 plus 2. And this we can write 5 times 6 times 5 under square root upon again remove the square root with this square. So 30 minus 5. So this is 35 plus 2 5 square under square root times 6 under square root. 30 minus 5 is 25 or it is equal to 35 plus remove the square root with the square 2 times 5 times square root of 6 upon 25 or 35 plus 10 times square root of 6 upon 25. Now we can take 5 common. So 5 then 7 plus 2 times square root of 6 upon 25. 5 times 5 is 25. We divide therefore 7 plus 2 times square root of 6 upon 5 is our final answer. This is how we simplify radicals.